Hey guys, it's Karstine again, and we are here back to making our little content stuff. Um, I know it has been a while since you guys have seen me. Um, I've just kind of been doing my own thing recently, just just working and playing games on my own and just working on my own kind of stuff. And I think it's about time that I get started doing this again. It's been a really long time. I think the last thing I really even streamed was at least six months ago, I want to say. Ugh, ages ago. But we are back. We're going to play a little game called Oxen Free, And I think we're going to just start out doing some videos here and there. And then we'll probably get back to streaming whenever here, like once or twice a week. But I think the videos are where it's going to be at. You guys let me know how you feel about it. If you want me to stream again, we can. Either way. Um, let's go ahead and get started. This is so funny. I meant to record this like last week. And I did record the first episode. And what ended up happening was I had doubled over my mic, and so you could just hear me repeating over myself the entire time. It was so stupid. But we're back. We're all normal. I'm going to take a quick drink of water, and we're going to get started. This game has a lot of its own audio, so that way I don't really have to talk over it, and we can kind of just watch it as a little story play out. Um, and we get to make choices along the way. If you guys want me to be like nicer or kind of more mean or anything, and if you're noticing I'm making too much of one choice, go ahead and write in the comments and we can switch it up and make it fun. Because I do believe we can change up the timeline and that we'll be able to have a second playthrough as well. And we'll be able to do some pretty cool and weird stuff. Um, one second. Good old Gatorade. All right. Let's go ahead and get started. It used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast yes, place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Music and the whole vibe is hey, so cool. For still this with game. us? I love it. You haven't said anything for like. I can watch the hypnotic rolling of the waves and listen to you at the same time. Oh, okay. What did I say? Little Miss, I can see and hear things at the same time. The cookies are great on Edwards Island. Used to be great, but you passed. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 8 p.m. Okay, I got so you all moved the timelines in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a... It's you know, right actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> okay. Uh, yes, please don't. Let's not relive their meet cute any more right, than we I have to. I can imagine to. it just being so weird. Like another and you guys just like met that. tonight? Yeah, I was, um... I've been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what? Does that make you her then? Hey, uh, second cousin? He's my stepbrother. Oh, second yeah. cousin? That kid's so sweet. I forgot that oh was even gosh. a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your clothes. No, that's the weird part. It's kind of so it? odd. The concept of just getting a new sister like a puppy, isn't it kind of awkward? <laughs> no, it's been totally bizarre. But just for the record, I don't consider you a pet. Love it. So, how do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic. Grade school era. I hate this Young game. enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. Oh. I mean, we both looked like little skin. Ah, Ren, why <laughs> are you even talking about this? Oh, it's humorous, right? It's just interesting. I think it's interesting. No, I hate people who think it's funny to make everybody uncomfortable. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Uh, wait, who's talking right now? It's a recording. They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be Why? Shouldn't we wait until we get there or at least meet up with the others? No, no, no. This is the core unit anyway. The rest are like our guest stars. And it's Jonas? Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. It's, um, biblical, right? Or is that the lion guy? 
I think every name's biblical, so probably. <laughs> Here's good. Come on, Alex, join the fun. She feels like she's there. A great. Awkward. I'll magic erase she's all the really words out and stuff, it. so don't worry. Hey, Alex, you like brought the radio, right? The little portable one? Yeah, of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? Thing. There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio, radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. Five she's filling years. in because Reggie got mono from some trip. Which I played because that song's been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But, oh, oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach, or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so... Hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. Of course it'd be his band name. That's so cheesy. Uh. <laughs> That's awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. What a creepy little area. We must be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. Undercook it? What about overcooking it? Oh man, I missed that game. That was so much fun playing that with Sage. Savage Sage. Ugh. This kid looks like he would just be so nerdy like that. Ugh. Forget about the loading screens on this one. I think I'm gonna have to come up with something you can do for it. Maybe we'll put like favorite snacks or something like that in the comments. So like for loading screen one, we'll do what's your guys' favorite candy? Mine right now is Snickers. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, yeah. uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, <laughs> so... Alex, you can bum one off me if you're empty. No. Oh, uh, no thanks. I don't smoke. The last time I had one, it didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> okay, <laughs> just checking. All right, my other friend should be up and around the bed. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have, like, two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends. Uh, Wait, is, is something wrong? What is it? Nothing's wrong, nothing's wrong. Right. It'll just take two minutes, super fast. It's like All right, but... <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're gonna have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all gonna meet no, up... No, it's... it's fine, Ren. Go on up ahead and we'll catch up with you. Um, okay. I guess. Though this is a really strange way to start off splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. I'll just be up the hill in case... Yeah, he's like, whatever. I guess I'll just be here by my fucking self. Ren seems nice. He's funny, you know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. Yeah, I mean, he's harmless. But, yeah, he's nice. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time oh, and say you've been here. cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And, like, getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels. That's fair. Not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. Yeah, I'm sure you miss your friends. Eh, there's not much to miss, to be honest. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so this... Oh yeah, man, no I problem. forgot about her brother Anytime. dying. That's right. I think that's why we have to meet one of, like, the really mean kind of people that we that's have to deal with. Nice oh, there's this one girl who's so Isn't fucking it? annoying. <laughs> I hate her. She's so bitchy. I think she has yeah. red hair in this one. We can catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. Let's just look at some of this other stuff over here, though. It's kind of kitschy, right? It's kind of kitschy? Yeah, it's like a quiche. Yeah, sorry, I checked my little phone. 
thing there for a second. Uh, I think they block this off at night since nobody needs to use it. Or maybe they just had a parade? Sure. Either one. Whose car is this? Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Really? Oh, there's always that one lonely car in every parking lot. I got the stairs too. This was even here. It's a monument to some submarine that was sunk off the coast. Oh, do the the um, the radio guide thing they talked about on the boat, you know? It's what, like oh, 102.3? Yeah. Uh, okay, sure. I think they said it's... Named after the Hawaiian god of the sea, the USS Kanaloa was launched on January 15th, 1941 and commissioned into service at the end of that year Never under the command of Lieutenant before. James Earl Kind of creepy in a way, right? On October yeah, 28, I hate thinking about it. It, it reminds Japanese me of those scenes in movies the where the sailors have to seal somebody up to drown or else the flooding will take the whole ship, you know? Yeah, no, I always thought submarine duty was like the worst possible war assignment. There's nowhere to go if something goes wrong. As well as 12 army passengers. I hate them. Named after the Hawaiian god of the sea, the USS Kanaloa was launched on January 15th, 1941. So cool and commissioned into service at the end of that year under the command of Lieutenant James Earl Clapman. On October 28, 1943, it was sunk. Let's get out of here. Migrate this. All right. Parks and Facilities Office. Friend's sister Allison used to work there. You'd like her. She's, she's tall. Tall. <laughs> um, all right. So it was tall enough to do anything. up early. I guess no point in staying open if nobody's here. That's true. Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be further up, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. <laughs> we are here to drink and be stupid. A tradition apparently started by board recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trolling. Uh -huh. Wait, how? The beaten path officially ends here. Okay, the beef is back at the I think the one Jerry thing told me that there's a way that you should get over there, but like if you I'm hear blanking on what it was. So but it's not, I mean, it can't be too difficult. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. Budge. Anyways, the town's youths keep the whole slink over and camp thing alive and well. No, 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 I, um, I, I got it. Uh, yeah, isn't this supposed to be like a giant swarming animal mask wearing freakout? Where's everybody else? Jesus, Alex, it's just supposed to be like a somewhat oversized kegger, and I think more people are coming. And the other thing is the weirdo caves. Weirdo, we caves. Love weirdo caves. The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the. It's like the front. The mouth. The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. You'll hear voices or just sounds. And they're in front. It's, uh, it's pretty creepy. At least I've heard. I did it once. It's amazing when it works. So back no, up that's a second. Creepy. Who's Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like, owns or owned some of the island or something. She's been shacked in the same spot for like 70 years. She's kind of what you call the local legend. She has a house. I can't imagine living in the same exact house, living with the same exact walls for that long a time. Well, it takes a certain someone. And actually, you know what? Speaking of the opposite of those certain someones, drum roll, please. Jonas, did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state? Dang, to college? I've never sat here this long and oh, like, really? listened to it. Yeah. So and did this little birdie tell everyone he did Susie Lyons, even though it was only over the pants uh -huh. stuff? Uh, hmm. uh, Just because Mark spends a study hall at the advisory board doesn't mean he's allowed to look through our submissions. That's look, so Alex, I just, if you are thinking of leaving, I just hope you're doing it for the right reasons. That's all. That's my whole spiel. Ren, why do you even care about this? Oh, I don't know, maybe because you're my friend? And I'll miss you if you go? That's what a friend does. They miss the other person. And I don't want you to regret anything. So, yeah, never mind. 
Oh, Ren. Yeah, big knucklehead. Weird. Yeah, I can't believe they I'd give me this you much too, dialogue okay? just for like walking a little but bit that way. But for now, I'm not gone yet, and who knows what I'm gonna do, so... All right, all right. Oh, you two are like kittens in a paper sack. Ugh, what is that? It's a saying. No, it isn't. No, it's <laughs> Let's see how cute to get out of here. How funny. Ugh. I haven't heard that saying in a long time. Two kittens in a paper sack. We like to take um, our big like mineral water boxes and we put all of our... Um, like we put the little brown paper bags inside of it and our kittens, our cats can play and hang out there. It's very cute. It's like a little fort. Man, this is the second loading screen, so we should do another loading screen question. Um, yeah, favorite snacks is what we're doing. What is your favorite kind of chips? Mine are the Flamin' Hot Dill Pickle Ones. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should, I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Who's that? That's, so, there's this girl, Nona. We love Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me, so just, you know, j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything. Be cool? Don't be like, just how you can be sometimes. Oh, and okay, Jonas, now that we're dumpster buddies, what was the thing that you said to Alex back there? Do you have one of those vestigial tails or something? Just leave it alone. Reginald, I hear you over there. Oh, hey, God, guys. Clarissa. Wait, I was saying... I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car? Oh, well, that can wait. Hey, okay. we started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Everyone, this is Jonas. Jonas? Everyone. Oh, man. Hey. Hi. And Jonas, Hi. that's... Who are you again? So cute. Jonas. Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Just that like, brother. Who are you in? Even though everybody really? just said his name. Yeah, I know. Yeah, this is his first night here, so everybody yeah, be on your best be nice. He's gonna Treat be him as you would a scary dog. Palms out. <laughs> That's um I don't bite. <laughs> it's fine. Wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? She that is Clarissa. How but are she's your stepbrother? Just kidding, sorry. Like, what does that even mean? Um My mom married his dad, so family, law, and all. I should have said take a Yeah, guess, well, I guess but... this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Uh, who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show Damn. up, but... Oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? Huh, <laughs> that's it. That's who you brought. That's Clarissa, the... seriously, who even invited right? you? Uh, uh, I did. Ren invited Nona, and Nona invited me. Though, begged me would maybe be the better way you know, to put it. Like uh, Nona, though, I, I didn't. Feel it in I didn't comments. really beg. Wait, aren't you all like friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to like a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> yeah, I'm. Well, get sorry. <laughs> I accept your apology. <laughs> oh, what a bitch. Thanks. You see, Jonas. Normally, oh, this is like a 20 deep her. rager, but Pat had a party last weekend, and... And a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, right? We're on Edwards Island. Forget those losers who couldn't handle the weekend, who didn't think we could make it, who lost my invitation, who had to go Faster. on there. We've been hearing about this for years, and now yeah, we're, we're gonna, gonna do gonna it. Head out. This is gonna be amazing, right? I don't want to deal with Clarissa being mean. Obviously, we still have to deal with it, but I'd rather just push forward on that. I hate her. She's so awful. Man, another little loading screen. I won't really count this one since we just did a little snack thing. You can do another kind of snack. What's your favorite, favorite kind of... Hmm. Favorite kind of... Soda. I'm a Dr. Pepper kind of girl. I should maybe pre-write some of these questions next time. Or if you guys have any good questions that you want me to ask next time, um, write Fire. in the comments below. Fire! Man's great equalizer. So, what's the, um, what's the, like, thing to do here? Man, these guys Other suck. than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Yeah, let's Can just drink? get drunk. It's supposed to be a party, right? Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. How what? Bitch. Yep, killed over three days ago. Just the way she says it, no way she's Local dead. Local news, anyway. Like, oh. Oldest living resident. 
Her family's been moving back and forth on the ferry, getting all of her crap. Oh, that's sort of a bummer. Yeah, well, right? we all gotta Sad. go sometime, in her case, later than sooner. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. That sounds and like sometimes not like a good play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Isn't it a uh, truth or dare? This is better than truth or dare because nobody ends up licking somebody's butthole. You get asked a question. You yeah, have to tell the truth, but if somebody can that. prove that you lied, the oh, accuser so gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Uh, how can you prove that somebody lied? Hearsay, rumor, conjecture, the usual. All right, let's just get on with it. Okay, so first we're gonna- I'll start, Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You wanna go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait. I want to hear his answer. Uh... It's just... Yeah, I could have just said Tyler for that one. That's fine. Could mean so many different things. Look, it's tough to gauge. He's, like, uh, so nervous. Something like... I love it. Enough stalling. I know you want to <laughs> sample the goods. No, no. They I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just like her as a friend. That's... That's all. She's cool. She's... All right. Great. Let's just <laughs> move on. Okay. It's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> uh oh. Ooh, wow, y'all have oh, please. Coffee or Shoot, after I this. can take it. Okay. Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? <laughs> it's fun. It's funny. I don't know. And I'd Jonas is family now, technically. So he's excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, I think. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. I do, Ren. We know each other the best, so it'd be like less weird. Yeah. And you're in a band. Yeah! I knew those bass <laughs> lessons would come in handy. Which, of course, means that you'd strangle Clarissa in her sleep sure if you ever got would, the chance. Dude. What a shocker. <laughs> eh, she got what was coming to her. Yeah, I mean, you did shove her into the community pool in sixth grade. <laughs> I did, didn't I? I was a hilarious yeah. kid. So, Alex's turn? Yep, ladies' choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great, here we go. What's your favorite stuffed animal? Um, <laughs> Nona. <laughs> yes. All right. So, does Clarissa <laughs> ever do anything that just like, really annoys the crap out of you? <laughs> Think carefully now. Um, you sometimes tap your nails on things when you're um, bored. <laughs> what? <laughs> what, that's it? Come mm -hmm. on, didn't she get to, like, second base with your cousin or something? Hey, he kissed me on the cheek when he was six on the swings. That counts. That counts, yeah. Um, Nona, you're up. Oh, uh, hmm. Clarissa, if you had to get a tattoo, what would it be? Hmm. A chick riding a motorcycle on fire. She didn't so ask you. A better question would be, what would she get when the artist refused to draw two dogs eating a dead baby on her forehead? <laughs> I'd get like a little ampersand on my ring finger. Oh man, I think I actually am so gonna get lame. that after I move out, so my parents can't say no. Neat. Clarissa's turn now. Alex, you got a new brother. Pretty exciting. Yeah, what up, I'm bitch. sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm is there, like, a question coming or what? I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. Um, that statistics no. show if you get divorced him. once, you're probably going to get divorced again. Girl, I'm going to fight And you. the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So let's put his mind at ease and hear Okay, just get to whatever point this is getting to. The point is, why did your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce. You know why. Michael died, and it broke everything, and they yeah. couldn't handle it. The end. Well, Feral. now you know, Jonas. Don't die, and everything will be fine. Okay, what Clarissa. Bitch. You, what? Uh, we hate you guys, Clarissa. honestly, I think I'm pretty Clarissa much ready to do anything chat. else besides this game. Wait, let's let's not stop like this. We should... Let Game's over, Ren. I won. And to celebrate, I'm going to sit on the beach and drink, and maybe, if I'm feeling spicy, fire, even take a nap. Set you on maybe fire. We can and that's exactly what Nona's going to do, too. Fine. Whatever, be Miss Pouty on the beach all night if you want. I'm not gonna let you ruin this for me. I appreciate your permission to be pouty, thank you. Cheese! If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosie, 
happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. No. Super. Uh, if we find anything more interesting than that, I think we'll be too involved in our own fun yeah, to come dude, get you. No, I would well, not wouldn't you know it? That's she just seems fine like by me. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Yes. No, no, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm but... very clingy, Ren. <sighs> fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's Let's just, uh, that. yonder. Yeah. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? Well, like I said, you're a strapping young lad. You're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh, yeah. Is it nice? Sweet. If you like bars on the windows. I want to go too. Let me come with you. Alex, you want to check out the caves or? Yes. Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up? Yeah, come on. Yeah. Come on, <laughs> I'll push you over. Oh, oh, I forgot. We never Whenever about you're John. ready. So, the cave. What's your bet? On a scale of one to ten, how weird's it gonna be? Super weird. It's run. It's exciting. So, definitely ten. Oh, I hate he seeing gets excited these easily, so but for the environment. he has the concentration of a goldfish. Don't make those in rivers, the guys. The fact that he keeps it. demanding we good. see it must mean something. <laughs> All right. It ruins their natural little habitats. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Eh, it's not your yeah, fault. Whatever. I think somebody dumped pig's blood on her in a previous life, and now Literally, she just wants no, to get ahead so of the curve. Mean. That makes sense. <laughs> yeah, probably. Thanks for uh, not ratting me out to Nona during the uh, the game. I didn't think you would, but, you know, you could have, and you didn't, so thanks. Well, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't throw you in the deep end or anything. Not like a certain person who yelled at Andrew Finnegan about a certain junior high dance right in the middle of gym class. That was a joke, and he agreed, so no regrets. Damn. Now, oh. who's ready to have their minds blown? Me. If you don't mean that literally. Me, me, me. Oh, wait, actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those look like brownies. Oh, you're the only one? Gimme. <laughs> oh, no. These are just for me. I've been waiting a oh, long man. time for this. Do you yeah. imagine doing that Maybe and not telling your friends? Maybe it's best he's the test balloon for this anyway. Hmm. Delicious. Okay, so see these little piles of rocks? The kids before us always leave them here, so you know where to try and tune in the signals. Okay. So you're going to want to stand basically right around here. And just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. How will we know when it's... You'll know. Ooh, Trust me. Too. Yeah. Holy crap! Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. It must be... Uh... Like... My running theory has always been like traffic reports from another galaxy, but... You know, if you move around it kind of changes too, I think. Like... Over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. This is so cool. I know! Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but they, they're they fine where they are. Yeah. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? She dated Michael for five seconds like three years ago. It was for a couple of months a year and a half ago. God, it sounds so... Yeah, it sounds... Uh... It sounds... Like, painful. Yeah. Wait, what was that? There's like... This is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous... No, I see it too. I'm sure there is something in there. Like... A giant rabies-filled bat, or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Or it kind of looks like a pool or something. Like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's check it out. Yeah. It's not that far in. If it's a pool, that'd be cool. I, um, didn't mean that to rhyme. <laughs> <laughs> cool pool. Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> Wait a minute! Jonas! Well, I am going to just rest against here, because I think, shh, I think I mismeasured the magic. That makes sense. Yeah, you do that. Do what? Ah. <sighs> Creep. 
creepy, but cool. Oof. Sinona seems nice, but we do not like Clarissa. She's mean. Hmm. Damn, this is a long loading screen. Okay, what is your favorite kind of soup, you guys? I don't have one. I love all kinds of soup. Um, chicken noodles really good. Or hmm, anything with like a sausage kind of thing in it is really tasty too. Okay, so it's been a full two hours since we arrived on the island. Jonas! Jonas! Climbing being kind of weird here and there. Perfect. Hmm. These are some deep ass caves for people to just be like wandering in. I hate that shit. Jonas, seriously, where are you? <sighs> it's like cool and like pretty, but I would never do this in real life. Like, that's so scary. something coming out of this water, like something awful. Why would a guy bring an ashtray down here? Or a pen? <laughs> You scared me. Oh, I scared you? <laughs> you scared me? Oh, God, I had no can't... idea where you were. I'm sorry for going ahead. I thought I thought I heard somebody down here, but you know, obviously there isn't. But isn't this place incredible? I mean, I don't even know how this how this happens. Yeah, I no, guess it's, must have climbed through here a lot to do some beautiful. Stuff. See? That's what I heard. It sounds like a person almost, right? Kinda? I don't know where it's coming from. Maybe it is someone. You ever think of that? Maybe it's the crazy guy who lives here and he's gonna eat out our stomachs. Eat out our stomachs? No. <laughs> well, where is he then? That would be awful. In which of these tiny air holes does he hibernate? <sighs> there was a light in here somewhere. I still want to see what made it. It must just be further in. Well, seeing as how I crawled in here to get you, yeah, might as well, I as well make the most through. of it. Yeah, and I mean, look, if it's cool, we can get the others, and if it's not, we'll just leave. Leaving is also a good option. I can't remember how far this goes. It might just be like a quick little jump. Oh yeah, it really isn't that far. Damn. Like, what is this made out of? Is it ice? What? Wow, how is that... Did you see the floating, um, triangle light thing? Um, yes. It must be like a, like a rainbow or like a reflection of light. Those, um, exist, right? Uh, maybe? Until last week I hadn't heard about parrotfish either, so I guess anything's possible. I think this is all tied to when you tuned in those weird signals out there in the, um, what am I trying to say? I, I think that you tuned in this little guy somehow. I think it's all the same thing. No. No way. There's like 20 things wrong with that idea, with the number one being radios don't conjure light beams. Yeah. Come on, it happened outside. It's not that far-fetched. Try your radio. Maybe that's like a frequency or something. Like if it'll have an effect. Yeah, good idea. Maybe it'll dance or twitch or something. 
Saw the man, not the dog. What the crap does that mean? A guy who can't see dogs? Did you see the first half? See a man about a dog? Yeah, I don't get it either. Hmm. Apart from the, um, triangle, this is honestly the craziest thing in here. Like, how did it even get in? And I mean, aside from some like, water damage, it's not really even that junky. Creepy. I know. Let's do it. Come on. Radio time. I am. Alex, really? I want to see what it's going to... Oh, my ah. God. Is this... Are you... Is this... You? Are you doing this? Uh, I... I think... submarine thing. Oh god, I hate it. I don't remember seeing that the first time. Ah, oh, oh, that was so creepy. <laughs> we hate that. Oof. Let's see how long is that? Okay. Oh, man. That is creepy, honestly. We might call that good, too. Because I think right after, it's, I, I kind of remember what happens after this. It, I think everybody gets like split up or something. But. No. Alex. Is it going to pause like this? Oh, it is. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, it's going to be all creepy. Uh, and then we get to see what happens to them in episode two, you guys. Oh man, this was a lot of fun and I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm going to try to get this one posted out soon and then I'm going to record pretty shortly after this and get the second one in. Oh, oh, this is going to be so much fun. It was, oh man, this was cool. I will talk to you guys in the comments and kind of keep you guys updated on the new series and everything that we're going to be doing as well too. I hope you have a really awesome day whenever you guys are watching this and I'll see you next time. Bye.